Hey, what's up, everyone? It's your boy Ian B. Johnson, and we are back to making the videos again. And yeah, I know I haven't made a video like damn near almost in five fucking months. I know I won't do that shit again. But I I came here to make this video to give you guys a really crazy theory and why everyone has been looking. Why has everyone been? There's one thing that people have been overlooking about Dragon Ball Sparking Zero is the fact that ever since March, we've been getting a lot of characters. If you guys really just like think about it, in March, they gave us the Power vs. Speed trailer, right? And they showed us like 11 characters. And for April, they showed us 10. And I've been realizing that ever since these past two trailers, they've been showing at least 10 to 11 characters. And I've been thinking, what if this, what if these next coming few months, they show us, you know, every 10 characters for every each month. And if you guys can't think about it, by the time September gets here, it'll be already like, already be like, what, 70 characters already shown, probably about all together, possibly 80, I could be wrong. But it's kind of crazy that they've been showing us multiple characters for every each month. And it, it makes it more insane that, you know, uh, for the Dragon Ball official website, um, they came up with an article saying that they're going to show us information every each month. And, you know, most likely, you know, they're going to show uh, characters, obviously, you know, without a doubt, they're going to show us characters. That's for sure. But I was like, wow, that kind of goes with my theory, what I've been saying for the past few days. And I can definitely see why Geekdom was saying that oh, the game is closer is gonna come out closer than you think. So I was just like, wow, maybe he knows a thing or two. And this is probably the only thing that how the whole community has been overlooking about Sparking Zero when it comes to the release date. And I strongly believe that the game will come out like this year, probably like around between October and December, I believe so. But at the same time, I do and I don't see release day coming to 2025 because like I don't think they'll wait that long just to like to release the game but let's just say if it does come out in 2025 I could probably see it coming out probably like around January the 25th probably like mid-January you know but yeah I was just like wow it's kind of crazy they released that article and this kind of goes with my theory too as well but for me, I'm really hoping for the next thing they show, I bet you they're going to show probably more than 10 characters. Hopefully 11 this time, like they did uh, for the Power vs. Speed trailer. Because they show us like a lot of fucking characters. Like, that's a lot of characters they're showing. But if you guys really just think about it, when September gets here, that roster is going to be looking really, really full. Right? And right now, all the characters that, that we have right now for this um this year is already like 61 characters i believe and that's probably already like what a good what 25 30 35 percent there of the roster they're already shown already and most likely dragon ball diamond characters they won't be shown for october because you know obviously they got promoted the dragon ball diamond anime um this year and you know they gotta show some moves what they do you know they gotta implement that into the anime so yeah we probably won't see dragon ball diamonds characters probably like later on maybe in december or november that's what i'm assuming really but most likely i feel like dragon ball diamond characters will be dlc including um what dragon ball super hero characters like beast go on orange piccolo and all that but yeah that's my theory that i've been having for the past few days i've been really the one to make this video because like it's really a crazy idea i feel like dragon ball sparking zero can definitely come out this year because you know it only makes sense that they're gonna give us information every each month including characters and i feel like every each month it is a possible chance you know they can give us a trailer but at the same time even if they don't give us a trailer for every each month v jump scans is even better you know that's better than nothing right but you know yeah i want to make this video and make sure you guys share this video and like and subscribe and enjoy your guys day goodbye